Welcome to Bad Normal Night. I'm Solo, both in name and in cast and crew, because I have no friends. Uh, I apologize for no intro animation or music today, or probably ever, if I do this show again. Uh, but I came up with the idea for this at 4 a.m., and that was like two weeks ago. And I don't even remember half the stuff that I was thinking of doing, so... Today we're going to be eating M&M's. Oh yeah, uh, this show is me copying and plagiarizing, I mean, uh, taking inspiration from a popular YouTube web show uh, that you may have heard of. I'm not going to say their names because it's pretty obvious, and I hope you're not stupid. Um, yeah, I'm doing things so that you don't have to, but you probably will anyway because you're a curious little human being just like me. But like I said, today I'm going to be eating some M&M's different flavors here. Uh, we've got the winning flavor, Crunchy Mint. We've got Caramel. We've got regular M&M's, we've got peanut M&M's, we've got white chocolate M&M's, and we have the good old fruit M&M's right here. So, we're going to be tasting each one of these, and I'm going to rank them based on which of the M&M's I think are the best. So let's get started with the Crunchy Mint M&M's. So this one, if you can see that, looks a little messed up, but it's pretty good. Nice minty flavor, not overwhelming. Let me put this one over here. This side is going to be the top today. Right here. This is the top. Next, I'm going to do the caramel m and I've never had these. I don't like m and I don't know why I'm doing this. But... Okay. They're pretty big. You can see them. They're just filled with caramel. I don't know what I expected. And I'm still let down. We're going to go mm, right there. Next up, we got the regular M&M's, the good boys, the famous boys. Let me swallow this one real quick. If I can even open this one. There we go. I had the wrong side. Okay. Just the regular M&Ms, you know what they look like. They're good. Solid candy. Not much more to say. They're milk chocolate with chocolate coating. They're good. I'm gonna put those right about here. Next, we got some peanut M&M's, and I'm on a diet for my kidneys, and I'm not supposed to even be eating chocolate or any kind of nuts, so hopefully these will kill me. That's what I'm hoping. So, they're just peanut M&M's. We all know what they are. See, I got a note in them. Pretty 
pretty good. I kind of like these a bit better than the regular ones. So, put those there for now. They're pretty good. Yeah. So far, the mint is definitely the best. That's okay. I don't know if I would want to eat them anymore. <clears throat> so I probably just wasted like a dollar thirty-five at Walmart getting those. Oh well. Oh yeah, white chocolate. Oops. Open before I showed the camera. They're a little bit bigger than regular M&Ms. There we go. You can see that. It's like white chocolate. Again, I don't know what I expected. But this time I'm not disappointed. There we go. I like this a bit better. Okay. So far, this is our order. Right here, we've got the Mint Boys, the Peanut Boys. The white chocolate boys, regular boys, and caramel boys. The last one that I'm going to be tasting, obviously, the fruit M&Ms, right here. We've got green apple, strawberry, grape, orange, and lemon. I've heard these M&Ms are pretty freaking good, so we'll give them a try. I've never had fruit-flavored M&Ms before. I don't know how I'm going to feel. How do you eat these? Do you eat them one at a time, one flavor, or do you go in, grab a handful, and mix all the flavors? Now it's lemon. It's pretty good. Alright, let's try grape. Grape's pretty good too. Green apple. You know what this is? Yeah. Then we got. Oh. I don't like that. I don't like that one. Mm -mm. Orange. Okay. And then, yeah, that last one, the red one, strawberry. Mm. Okay, so reconsidering everything. I'm going to get one more of everything and then I'm going to do my final ranking. Right now, the fruit M&M's are right here. So, I reach in here, grab a mint. Pretty crunchy, pretty minty, pretty good. Peanut boy. Okay. Still really good, but not as good as this. Pretty good, pretty good.
nasty and the caramel ones. So, to revisiting caramel, I think I want these. You like that. Okay. So here are the rankings. Rum. Best M&M's to worst M&M's. Number one, you got your mint. Minty boys. Nice and crunchy, minty. You good? Then you got your peanut boys. Big old nut in the center. Nice chocolate. Pretty good. White chocolate, no surprise. That was pretty good. I would probably eat those again. Caramel gets stuck in the roof of my mouth and my teeth. It's okay. Not my favorite. I might eat them again. Here's where I was let down the most. I heard so many good things about these fruit flavored M&Ms. And I'm just not feeling them. But they are better than the regular M&M's. So, that is my conclusion. Um, yeah. That's all I've got. Thanks for watching, I guess. Whatever. Uh, until next time. If there is a next time. I don't know.